again, I suppose that shocking text. How did that feel? Because that was a big surprise for everybody. Yeah, no, it was obviously very shocking. Like, even though he did it, was shocking. Like, they've never done that before. Yeah. And um, obviously, me and Ellen getting announced was shocking because obviously, you know, we did get along. Everyone in the village thought that we got along. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it was just very shocking. Yeah. yeah. And especially because it was a least compatibility um, vote. How do you feel about that? Do you know what? Yeah. Can't lie. Um, looking back at it, I'm just like, it's shocking. Very shocking, but yeah. at the same time, <laughs> at the same time, like the love I end up, the islanders over there as well, mm -hmm. Montel, can, Montel and Nia can obviously vouch for as well. Like, we were very compatible in the villa, it's obviously showing our love as well, so it's quite shocking. Yeah, who, <laughs> if you could replace you guys, who do you think should be sat in this position instead of you then? Who's gonna say, um, uh, suspense, right? Suspense. <laughs> I was going to say, um, at the time we was in the villa, I was going to say Scott and Abby, mm -hmm. only because, um, sorry, sorry about that, Scott and Amber, only because there was only like a friendship vibe there, okay. and like they wasn't really trying anything, but now Scott is obviously coupled up with Abby, good luck to him. Okay, fair. Well, Catherine, let's talk about Scott, because before Cassar, you obviously were with him. Um, what do you think went wrong there? What, what didn't happen? Obviously, like, things were good between me and Scott, but there was just a lot of uncertainty around it. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, before everything, obviously, you know, the fireplace situation, things were just not up in the air. Um, you know, when we spoke about when Newcastle was coming up, we both said we were open. You know, every time Bonshaw came in, Scott wanted to get to know them. So, you know, we just left stuff in uncertainty. There, like, there was just no definition there. Okay. So did you not expect Scott to do anything in Castle then? Yeah. Or you did? Honestly, I did, just okay. because we had conversations about it. Um, so obviously when I saw him stood alone, I was obviously shocked. Right. Yeah. So in your mind, you go to Casa, you're both pretty much open, he's doing his thing, you're doing yours. Yeah. So when you returned, what did that feel like seeing him on his own then? It was a very, very tense situation. Like, yeah. we've had some tense moments in the villa, and that was by far the most tensest, um, if that's a word. The, ten the most tensest. <laughs> the most yeah. tense. um, obviously, I didn't like seeing him alone. Like, you know, I care for Scott. And obviously, seeing him there, mm -hmm. you know, I did have, like, a gut feeling. Like, you just had to feel it mm -hmm. to be there. And obviously, I felt bad. Like, you know, I just wanted to speak to him. I just wanted to tell him everything, you know? Yeah. And Ellen, how was that for you? Because obviously, it's really awkward. I mean, I was right there, and you were like, okay. Hey. Um, what goes through your mind in that situation? <laughs> Do you know what? In Casa, when I coupled up with Catherine, I was like, yeah, I can't lie. Winning. I mean, I'm literally winning, yeah. like, do you understand? But walking into the villa, I was thinking, yeah, the guy, the guy. And then standing around the fire pit, I'm just like, oh, long day, long day. Yeah. <laughs> at, the same time, at the same time, I was happy. It was like mixed emotions, because I'm coming back with Catherine. Mm -hmm. We've obviously got a co um, good connection there as well. But emotions and tensions were building up. But it was, it was good overall. Yeah. Okay, well, we kind of got to talk about this bit, because from the outside, it looked like everything's going well between you and Catherine. And then out of nowhere, you're like, uh, by the way, if there's bombshells, I want to get to know them. Where does that come from? Because there wasn't even a bombshell at that point. Bye, <laughs> <laughs> bye. Oh, boy. Let him out. Do you know what it is? That on the outside world, I'm a type of person that literally, when things are going well, I tend to like self sabotage things. Okay. But I think too much into the future and I'm not in the moment as well. So. Being in the villa made me realise I just got to enjoy the moment and being with Catherine made me enjoy the moment as well. Okay. Well, 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 um, <laughs> and now that you're outside of the villa, have you guys got a chance to watch back any of it yet or no? No, like we've literally just been out for two days and even the first day wasn't even a day because we got back in the evening. Busy, busy. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And so who, in your opinion, is the most compatible in there right now? I have to say my girl with me. When he has such a great personality and love and bounces off it, and I just see them so refreshing, like you just smile, you know, and it's just so lovely to see. Obviously, Ellen Ty as well. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, I watched the love story. It was literally like watching a love story as well. Like, it was just amazing. Wild. Is there anything that you want to say that, like, maybe you feel like you didn't get to express while you're in there, or? Yeah, um, obviously, you know, you literally only see an hour out of a 24 hour day. Like, you know, things were said, mm. parties were there. <laughs> um, you know, me and Scott were in a good place, we are still in a good place. Like, okay. you know, you know, what you didn't see is us all chilling after was, you know, you know, 
if I wasn't with Ellen, I'd be with Winnie and Scott. Like, yeah. we were in a good place, you right. know? And we were just, you know, what you need to understand is us. Like, you know, there are feelings there. Mm -hmm. um, so when you have arguments, things do get tense. And I never wanted to carry myself the way I did. I didn't want to get like that. But, you know, when you do care about someone, Emotions come, emotions come out. Emotions come out. Yeah. Like, you know, like, it's, yeah, it's just... Yeah. Yeah. Every single second of seeing you both, Catherine, you, you're an OG, so you've got a massive...